Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you what a landing page is, how they work, and if you actually need one to become a successful affiliate marketer. I'm also gonna show you examples of what like real life cash generating affiliate landing pages look like. And then I'm gonna break down the five simple but most important elements that every single landing page needs. And if you stick around to the end, I'm gonna show you how you can get completely done for you landing pages that you can start using as soon as you're done watching this video. Okay, let's dive in. So what is a landing page? A landing page for affiliate marketing is a singular web page created by an affiliate marketer to promote products or services from another company. That's the most basic definition. This singular page is designed to convince people to take one specific action, usually by clicking on a link or a button that leads to the company's website where the customer can then make a purchase and then you get paid a commission. Now, landing pages are very different than traditional websites that most of you are used to seeing. A website has a header, a footer, multiple places to click around and multiple things to do. We're all familiar with that. A landing page is one single page that directs a customer to take one single action that you want them to take. And for you as an affiliate marketer, that's usually clicking your affiliate link. Now, contrary to what you probably see on YouTube or everyone else talking about on the internet, these landing pages, guys, they can be incredibly simple and sometimes they're downright ugly. Now, the big question that everyone always asks is, do I need a landing page for affiliate marketing? And a lot of gurus out there are gonna tell you, no, you don't need one, or they're gonna try to teach you how to do affiliate marketing without a landing page. And while sure, you can make affiliate marketing work without landing pages or even a website, guys, it's actually a lot easier to make sales with one simple landing page. You don't need to build a giant website. Again, you're building one page that's gonna help convert your potential customers into buyers. So the simple answer to the question, do I need a landing page for affiliate marketing? Short answer is no, but the most successful affiliates use them in every single one of their campaigns. So I would argue you do need one to see the best results. So let's break down how this works. You're basically gonna be generating traffic and that's gonna be something like a Facebook ad or a YouTube ad, or if you're doing free traffic, that could be a social media post or a TikTok video. Anyway, you're convincing people that they need to go click on your ad or post. From there, once they click, they're gonna be taken to your landing page. And then once they're on your landing page, they're gonna click on your affiliate link, they're gonna be taken to the seller's sales page, and then purchase the product, and you just earned a commission. Guys, I want you to think of landing pages as the bridge, basically, that are taking customers from your ad or post to your affiliate link, and then on to purchase. It's a very important step in the buyer's journey, so you can help guide and convince them that the product they're about to purchase is right for them. And here's another thing. If you're planning on running Facebook ads or YouTube ads or pretty much any paid ad platform, these platforms require you to have a landing page. It's not optional, meaning you can't just place your affiliate link in your ad. There has to be a landing page in order for you to get your ad approved. Even if you're not planning on running paid traffic, let's say you're just doing free traffic on like Instagram or TikTok, most successful affiliate marketers still have a link in bio, which is a form of a landing page. Make sense? So again, do you need a landing page? The answer is yes, if you're serious about earning consistent commissions. Now, as promised, let's take a look at what these pages actually look like. I mentioned before, they can be incredibly simple and sometimes downright ugly. And guess what? That's a win for you because they're proven to convert and you can literally build these in as little as 30 minutes. Let's take a look at this high converting example of a landing page built for promoting a weight loss offer on ClickBank. It's super simple, right? And guys, this was built using the five key elements that every single successful affiliate marketing landing page should have. Let's break down this page by starting with key element number one. The first element is a headline. Now, the headline is the most important part of your landing page because, guys, it's the first thing a customer is going to see when they land on your page. It should make the reader curious, and its sole job is to get the customer to continue reading your page. So this headline reads, Ivy League Discovery shows a simple 17 second morning ritual that turns on your body's hidden fat loss switch to melt one pound of fat every 43 hours. Now, for someone interested in losing weight, this headline does an excellent job at piquing curiosity. What is this hidden fat loss switch? What could this simple ritual be? Are you starting to see how this works? It's also time bound, so the customer feels at ease about how this 17 second ritual can work into their daily routine. They even start working within 43 hours. And guys, it even has social proof in this. Check this out. We're leveraging the trust and the prestige of an Ivy League school to show social proof. Plus, it even has the customer's desired outcome of losing weight quickly, right? One pound every 48 hours. Again, guys, the whole purpose of a headline is to pique curiosity and just get the customer to continue reading, which this headline does a great job of. Okay, now let's look at element number two, the copy, which is just a fancy way of saying text. Now, 
This is usually right below the headline, and this is the very next thing the customer will read. Notice how it's one sentence with a couple of bullet points and continues to pique that curiosity. Copy on your landing page is basically an extension of your headline, furthering the curiosity with more of a story. Now, this sentence was pulled directly from the seller's sales page and is rooted in how they sell this product. Megan C, for example, is the spokesperson for this product. She's relatable to the target audience of older women, and it's Megan's story who the customer will want to learn more about and who they'll see when they watch the video. And guys, this copy is also outcome driven. Notice how it says something around losing weight from the common areas of the body where people usually gain weight. So let's look at the bullets now. A lot of times you're gonna see these bullets address potential objections that the customer might have. In this example, the customer may be thinking, oh my God, not another workout program, or is this some fad new diet that I have to follow, or gosh, I'm probably gonna have to stop eating all my favorite foods. Notice how those bullet points clearly and easily address all of those objections. Again, still piquing the curiosity of the customer, wondering what is this discovery? And lastly, you have one simple sentence, a seven word sentence, and that's not even the full story. This simple sentence sets the customer up to want to hear the full story and they're so curious of what is it, what is it? Okay, I'm gonna pause right now. Notice how nothing on this page talks about the product itself. This is such an important piece most new affiliates miss. You don't have to sell the product on your landing page. Your job is just to pique curiosity of the customer and get them to want to learn more about the product. And that's what makes these pages so high converting. The customer is dying to know how is this possible? And now you've just exponentially increased your chances of getting this customer to buy from your affiliate link. Now, I'm gonna cover more of why this is so important in just a second, but first, let's move on to the next key element. Element number three, the call to action. Aside from the headline, this is the second most important part of your page. This is where you're gonna give the customer an action to take. In this example, it's the button, see how she did it. The customer knows who Megan C is. They wanna see how her weight loss journey went for her, how she did it with this 17 second morning ritual. So our call to action, which is our little blue button right here, is simply convincing people to click to watch her story. Starting to make sense how this flow and how a customer would be very enticed to click and watch this call to action and watch the video. This is the cool part. This, in this button, this is where you place your affiliate link, which leads me to key element number four, your affiliate link. Now, when a customer clicks on your call to action button, your affiliate link is embedded in that little blue button and then you get credit for every sale that you make. You'll be able to track every click, every sale, and every commission you make with this special link. And the best part is that it's hidden inside your call to action button, so there's no weird looking long link that's visible on the page. And notice, this page has one clear focus, to get people to click on that call to action button, which is your affiliate link. So the only thing people can do on this page is click on your affiliate link, learn more about the product, and eventually purchase the product that you're promoting. See how this is wildly different than a regular website? Now listen, there are tons of ways affiliates embed their affiliate links on their landing pages, but for this example, I just want you to notice how easy and how clear it is for the customer to click on this button. And finally, the fifth and final key element of this page is the imagery. The imagery on your landing page should be minimal and again, curiosity invoking. Like I mentioned earlier, a lot of new affiliates make the mistake of using an image of the product that you're actually promoting. That's wrong. Your image should be another tool to pique the curiosity of the reader and then further the story that you're telling. Now, notice on this page, it looks like a video player. This is actually just an image that was taken from Megan C's story on the seller sales page with a simple play button added over it. Guys, this is a great tactic that a ton of super affiliates use to get people to watch the video. Again, we're just trying to get and see, watch to see how she did it. So all it is is an image with a little play button that ties to the story. And here's the cool part. If someone clicks on that image to play the video, your affiliate link is also embedded in that image. So when someone clicks it, it opens your affiliate link, which directs to the seller sales page. They go watch the story of Megan C. Boom, you earn your commission. I wanna reiterate, your imagery should tie in with the story that you're telling on the page. And it can literally just be a screenshot or a unique image that you think is gonna help further the curiosity of the customer. It does not have to be anything fancy. You can use this play button trick if you like. And guys, again, notice how this page has no mention of what the product is, what it's called, what it looks like. It's because the seller's sales page is very good at introducing the product and selling the actual product itself. So you don't have to do that. Most sellers spend thousands and thousands of dollars to make sure their sales page converts extremely well so that you can feel confident sending potential customers over to their page with your affiliate link. Okay, so let's recap the five elements. You have a headline, simple copy that furthers the story and addresses possible objections, a clear call to action, 
your affiliate link, and then some simple imagery. That's it. Pretty simple, guys, right? I mean, it's, it's not hard to build these pages. Now, not every single landing page is gonna look like the one we just showed. There are tons of ways to design these, but the five core elements are still present in every single affiliate landing page. Let's take a look at two more high converting examples and see if you can spot the five elements. So let's take a look at this page. It looks a little different, right? And the strategy is a little bit different, but it still converts like crazy. Now, the primary goal of this page is to capture a customer's email address in exchange for a free guide. The customer enters their email address and then you send them a freebie or something of value. But now you have their email address so you can continue promoting the product to your customer via email without sending them to your landing page again. Now, there's a lot of upsides to email marketing, way too much to cover in this video, but this is a strategy affiliates use all the time to continue promoting products to their audience. So, see the difference? The first example, the whole goal was to get a customer interested in the product that you're promoting and prep them to watch Megan's story by clicking on your affiliate link. This page's sole goal is to collect an email address and promote the product to your customer via email. But look, the five elements still exist on this page. Can you spot them? You have an interest peaking headline, good solid copy, a CTA, imagery of the freebie, and the only difference is you're gonna be using email to send your customers your affiliate link and the product that you're promoting. Make sense? Cool, let's look at one more. This is another high converting landing page, but kind of looks like a news article, right? That is the whole point. This article was written like a news article and it also reads like one, but the five core principles are still the same. You have your interest peaking headline. Copy here is a little bit more of a new style read, but it's still curiosity invoking and mentions this new groundbreaking study. Now your call to action is a little bit different here and it's actually the hyperlink text, which people are gonna be curious what that is and they click on it, that's your affiliate link. And then you have clear imagery that matches the story all the way through and so it feels like a news article. So again, totally different design, but the five core elements still exist on this page. So listen guys, if you're on the fence about building a landing page, if you're scared, whatever, I'm serious when I say this, literally anybody can do this and you can build one in less than 30 minutes. Landing pages can greatly increase your conversion rates and are one of the most important pieces you can have in your entire affiliate arsenal. And guys, as you can see, they can be very simple. They come in all shapes and sizes and they just have the five core elements that you need to focus on. And again, right? These pages aren't beautiful. They're kind of ugly, but they work. So the next question is, if you're bought in, how do you actually build these pages? Guys, the simplest way to do it is with a landing page builder. There are softwares out there that allow you to make these landing pages in honestly, just a couple of clicks. Now, the problem with a lot of the landing page builders out there though, is that a lot of them are really, really expensive. And most of them are built for a wide variety of uses, which means a lot of the templates and the features and all the stuff that you get with it aren't really tailored to you as an affiliate, but they're more for the masses that literally everyone on the planet uses them. So they can get a little wonky. Now, my personal recommendation, if you are an affiliate marketer looking for affiliate products to promote and build landing pages, just like the ones we cover, my recommendation is Accelerator. It's really the only landing page out there that's specifically built for affiliates that wanna build landing pages and earn commissions. In fact, in the examples that I just showed you, all three of them are the highest converting templates that Accelerator offers, and they all come preloaded, ready to go. So all you have to do is basically fill in the blanks. And guys, it's incredibly cheap compared to all of the other landing page builders out there. So if you're looking to build your first page or you've maybe even dabbled with some affiliate marketing before, check the link in the description below. We've linked to the Accelerator page for you to explore. And guys, as promised, if you wanna get the landing pages completely done for you, pre-written with the headline, the copy, CTAs, and the imagery that are all ready for you to promote. So you can basically skip everything we just covered in this video. I want you to check this out. There are four done for you landing pages that honestly have helped affiliates generate five, six, and even seven figures on ClickBank that you can get access to right now. All of the headlines and the copy that you saw in this video, guys, these templates are actually packed with all of the direct response tactics and language that is made intentionally to move someone from a viewer into a customer. So if you're wondering, I don't even know how to write some of these headlines or copy something like this, it's all done for you. And maybe you're super early in your journey and you don't even know what product you wanna promote yet. That's why these templates are pretty cool is because they're made specifically from some of the best selling offers on ClickBank. So that means you'll know exactly what offer to promote. You don't have to go searching around and then you'll have a landing page already built for you, ready to launch. So if you're interested or even intimidated by building these types of pages, guys, this is a great resource. Check the link in the description below to get access to these templates. They can save you a lot of time and wasted hours of hassle building these pages, wondering what to write. Okay guys, so now that you know what a landing page is, you know how they work, you should finally see why you should want to use them in your affiliate campaigns. They're easy to build, 
They require a small bit of writing and you guys don't have to be a computer riz to figure this out. So I encourage you guys, go out and explore the landing page softwares. Find one that you like and start building these pages because they seriously can be a game changer for you and how much money you earn online. And if you're still watching, all I ask in return for creating this video for you is to hit that subscribe button. We are posting stuff like this every single week and our sole goal is to help you get better at affiliate marketing. And guys, if you're still confused on landing pages, drop a comment below and let us know what you need help with. We'd be happy to make a video for you and explain it fully in depth. Cheers and let's go earn some commissions.